I am Saurav Roy from Media and Public Relations Committee of IIM Raipur. Today we are honored to have Shri Anjani K. Jajodia, who is the Vice President and the Executive Assistant to the Managing Director and CEO of uh, Open Network for Digital Commerce, ONDC. We welcome you to our 8th Leadership Summit, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. So, sir, I have few questions for you. If you uh, let us, we will get sure. on with it. Sir, uh, you've been an integral part of the finance departments in several companies, including FMCG giants such as uh, ITC and leading digital platforms like Zomato and ONDC. Uh, was this a career path something you had always envisioned or did it evolve eventually? So, uh, Saurabh, as you rightly said, that I'm for, uh, primarily a finance expert and uh, I, I started my journey with ITC handling various roles into finance, be it around controllership or strategy or business finance or FP&A. And eventually I got an opportunity to lead the finance uh, function for two of the businesses of Zomato. Uh, in a finance professional's journey, there is always an inflex point, whether he or she wants to be a CFO or it, he or she wants to be a CEO, right? If you take uh, Mr. Sagata, Maria, Sagata Gupta from Merico, mm -hmm. one of the chartered accountant who is a CEO. Yes. So I also wanted to test my hands and deepen my understanding around strategy and uh, how to run an organization because running an organization itself is a very, very different management chapter. Uh, and I, I got, a, I was lucky to get an opportunity to shadow Mr. Thampi Koshi. Uh, who's a digital celebrity uh, as a managing director of uh, ONDC. So I just happened to grab this opportunity. Uh, me, yes. sir. I think many students would be inspired from that and then they can also have a vision for themselves. Definitely. So uh, going to the next question, uh, how do you perceive the current technological landscape and what do you see as its most significant opportunities for driving financial growth? and innovation so uh, the technology landscape or the tech stack of india is uh, maturing really fast uh, it is at a transformational uh, arena currently rather than at a developing stage uh, and and tech will of course uh, play the most pivotal role when it comes to driving profitability in an organization uh, in companies like itc I, i've seen how uh, data has just got married to a itc way of operation because 2013 was a area arena uh, 13 was a year when you know a, a digital or digitization or automation was the first time when india was trying to adopt that and uh, I, I joined itc in 2013 so i've seen the both the journey the completely manual journey to a mid-sized uh, uh, tech layered company uh, in an itc ecosystem while i've also seen a in a hyper paced uh, organization such as zomato which is very, very tech heavy, uh, heavy, how technology has been, technology and data has been leveraged to drive paths to profitability. In one of the businesses which I was handling, we were like at a the high double digit loss per month, uh, very, very similar to the traits of any of the startup mm -hmm. currently. And I've seen how my finance team has leveraged technology to drive in efficiency in every single line of the P&L. So okay. the tech will be the game changer and it will be very important for every finance functional uh, to, to really leverage tech, uh, both from the profitability side as well as the risk aversion side. Uh, that has been very insightful, sir. Yeah. Uh, sir, coming on to the third question, uh, what was the defining X factor that significantly influenced your trajectory of your career? Uh, that's very interesting question, Saurabh. I think that's uh, always a hunger to do more or ne never settle down for uh, anything which is mediocrity. Uh, I, I, I always learn doing finance, but I, I believe uh, that uh, I enjoy doing the business part of it equally well. And it is just that in the suit to marry both the things, I chose my journey uh, into a business strategy and finance over controllership role. Uh, having said that, controllership, of course, is extremely important and critical uh, because that's a backbone of any organization in the financial sector. Uh, many uh, students at IIM Raipur, they are also very motivated to uh, not settle for mediocrity. So Absolutely. we hope that we are also able to deliver the same. 
and sir uh, your thoughts on uh, e-commerce versus uh, quick commerce i think uh, e-commerce is more sustainable while uh, quick commerce is uh, quick commerce is more of convenience and fast uh, uh, while i do not have any hard feelings for any of the quick commerce i am a heavy user of a quick commerce uh, but uh, two two food for thought for the viewers one is that do we exact do we actually need a quick commerce uh, is it adding any value to the ecosystem or it is just an adrenaline rush uh, which we enjoy when a door bell rings very fast and also uh, you need to be very very careful uh, while navigating into a quick commerce uh, because it can really weigh heavily on your pockets uh, there's a very very sweet price uh, which comes attached to this convenience and uh, people often fail to realize how much uh, heaviness it is bringing on their pockets true sir i think people are getting very influenced quickly from the quick commerce yes. that is correct and sir to end uh, i have my last question uh, with your extensive experience in finance what key advice would you offer to i am ripo students who aspire to become future financial leaders so my my advice to any finance profession is very simple that uh, finance exists because of business right and you often what happens that in the uh, in the hunger to or in the excitement to implement robust controls and process into the system we we somewhere crosses the line we we somewhere often try to cross the line and it, these are not business friendly implementation so if your financial activities cannot enable the business i think uh, somewhere you have lost the game so always be business friendly and you you need to co-pilot your ceo uh, rather than just be a back end function uh, don't don't shy away from taking the front seat uh, as a co-pilot or a cabin to your ceo and always go very very deep into the business uh, have very very strong understanding of a business and uh, as a finance professional you are very very uniquely placed to go to have an opportunity to go deep into every aspect of business be it sales be it marketing technology every single line item gives you that an opportunity unlike uh, any other profession so leverage that and enjoy your financial journey the most you can thank you so much sir i think our students have a lot to learn from our uh, conversation uh, thank pleasure. you for joining us at i am raipur my pleasure your insights have been very valuable and we hope to see you again soon in future Definitely, sir. It's always a pleasure to come to such large institutions and share whatever little learnings we have. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Thanks.